Aren't they beautiful? Happy belated birthday to me, you guys. This video will be all about what I did for my birthday, who I did, where I do it at. You know the vibes. Yo, who am I? I go by J. I ain't know no savage shit. Free JT, I am that bitch, but I am not your bitch. I still pop my lips, still snap. Yeah. What's going on, J Squad, Plum Squad? I need your help for this YouTube promo to help subscribe. And don't only just subscribe, you guys, but support for longevity of time. It's Evie. She currently has 708 subs. I'm trying to help her get to her first 1,000 subs, you guys. And just to give you a little insight of what she will be doing, she's a chill, laid-back person, and she definitely is. She believes that love wins. She's currently working to better quality for her videos, and she's actually making some progress, but she do vlogs, pranks, story times, motivational quotes. From time to time, she does cash app giveaways, and she's fun and caring, love helping people. She's shy, but it's a process. Um, of learning more of how to do things on YouTube. She has a girlfriend, and not to put her girlfriend business out there, but her girlfriend is very unique in herself. She's battling things, and I wish that. It's Evie. You open up about it, tell people about it, go to her channel, find out all about what she has going on in her everyday life with her girlfriend. On the job, all that good stuff, you guys. I do wish you the best of luck. Keep grinding, keep going. Do not stop, do not quit, no matter what you have going on in life. Make time for what you really want. And I wish your channel the best of luck. Let her know that J Vibe sent you. There's a whole lot of great vibes going on. Big period. It's easy. It's only up from here. Make sure you go subscribe and support. Enjoy the video. What's going on, J Squad? Plum Squad, it's your girl J. You already know. Welcome back to J Vibes, where there's a whole lot of great vibes going on. Big period. Today, you guys, I'm officially 26 years old. Happy belated birthday to me, you guys. This video will be all about what I did for my birthday, who I did, where I do it at. Just like a birthday action story time over some nice fried shrimp, you know what I'm saying, with the broccoli and cheese rice. And you know, just chit chat, talking my mess because I love rice. Please make sure you like this video, comment down below, share, and subscribe to my channels. Click the links in the description box, you guys. I know you got a lot of questions, like question number one, Jay, what happened to your nail? If you was on live that night, you know what happened. Yeah, so I'm 26 year old, 26 year old, 26 years old. Oh, it's gonna take some use. Let me say my damn prayers. Amen. Mm. 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 Prior to my birthday coming, I cannot keep my pants clean. Dang, I just, it's not even three minutes in the video. I already got Texas Pete on my pants. We got tartar sauce? It wouldn't be open, right? So prior to me actually bringing in my birthday, I had to go spend some time with my honey. Yes, ho, I took your word. I'm not talking to you, babe. I'm talking to her. Yeah. Oh my god. I can't. I just wanna, you know, I just wanna eat. Oh yeah. Shoot. Spent some time with my honey, and then I got on the road and I went to go spend some time with my mom. My grandmother, my cousin, my aunt. Did I see my sister? Yeah, I see my sister. My sister. Where was my little brother? I don't know. He ain't texting me back. Who's that? Huh. Anywho, the night bringing in my birthday in, I was at my grandma's house. It was getting kind of late. And I was like, you know, grandma, mama, I'm going to leave. My mama, she can hold secrets, but it's kind of hard for her to hold a secret. So my cousin had her up on the phone, and she acting all suspicious, you know what I'm saying? All sneaky. I said, what y'all got going on? She was like, none of your business. And I was like, okay. I said, see, this is what I don't got time for. So I left. I get to my cousin house. Dara is there. Y'all gonna be like, who is this? I don't know if I get y'all this story time, but I will have maybe about two story times about me and Dara. Now, dang, everything coming through. I'm just trying to eat my food. I need that. Yeah. So I pull up. Dara was there. My cousin is there. And my cousin got me a little cake. I done cut it into pieces, shared it with my grandma, my mama, ate some, 
Gave some to my cousin and my aunt. But it was a double layer vanilla cake. I love vanilla, but if it's a real velvet cake or a chocolate cake, I really need my cake to be made from scratch. Gotta be made from scratch. Vanilla cake, yeah, you go pick that thing up. I love whipped cream icing. Like, I love icing, but whipped cream icing is so light. It's still so sweet and still so good. We turned up on the cake. Well, no, we didn't. I ain't cut a piece until the next day. We turned up on some Alfredo. My cousin asked me what I wanted to eat, so she cooked for me. She made me some Alfredo with shrimp because shrimp is my favorite seafood. But you can't give me shrimp without crab legs. Unless it's the Alfredo style, then I'll make an exception. She likes scallops. And I was like, you know, yeah, 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 throw, throw some scallops in there. But they were the baby scallops. And they were actually good as hell. Okay, especially in all the sauce and the noodles. Very delicious. So then, mm, mm. later on that night, still bringing in my birthday. Well, my birthday ain't even come yet. We was turning up. On some tequila. What type of tequila? I've never had this tequila in my life. So you came to the live. I was in country girl style form. And yeah, that live is no longer available. But if you was there, you was there. If you wasn't, you wasn't. You know what I'm saying? Just a big period. Next, now when I woke up. I woke up, y'all, in, in even more rare form. I woke up, ladies. Because this is strictly for the ladies. Okay? And Linda was over there. You know Linda that go to everybody's house? And stay for a few days. It causes lack of oxygen in the bloodstream sometimes. Yeah, Linda had came over there and I was like, oh, look at Linda showing up right on time. Linda was actually late because I had already got me. <laughs> Ew. You know, Linda had me in rarer form than I was the night before or the night bringing in my birthday. I was cramping, I was hurting. So I had to get myself together. About 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock, I got myself together, went to my grandma's house, you know what I'm saying, chill with my grandma, I got my life, my grandma. I spent time with my grandma. This birthday felt very different in a great way. Like, I can't remember the last time I had a birthday where I literally got to do and had the option to do anything I wanted, not considering nobody but me. I didn't have to hurry up and get dressed because ain't nobody waiting on me to get dressed. I ain't had a choose between these options because somebody gave me an option to choose from. I literally could just do whatever I wanted to do for my birthday. We gotta stop saying it's crazy. It's amazing how God works. Because some of y'all know that I was supposed to be in Houston for my birthday. That was necessarily not the plans. I actually had canceled that trip weeks prior to my birthday because it was just like, mm, this isn't the move right now. It's amazing how God works. Like, although my grandma was in the situation that she was in, she did a complete 360 on her health. They were talking about putting her on life support. I'm trying to tell you, prayer is real. My grandma woke up the next day. They had her in a regular room. The next day, maybe two days, she was released. And then within 24 hours, she was back in the kitchen cooking. It's like, Sit down. I mean, all you could do was literally just watch her cook. You know, back in the day, we would just let her go in the kitchen do her thing. Now, it's like, oh, you about to cook? Okay, let's everybody go in the kitchen. We, we all cooking. So, to be around family, I cannot remember a birthday that I had spent with my mom. Let alone just family, you know? Like, no friends, no no girlfriends, no no strings attached. No, no with nobody. Like, nobody around but just me and my family and i really appreciated it greatly deeply it, it meant a lot to me you know just to have that one-on-one -on -one time it was just it, it was it was a good feeling and now i'm back at home you guys i'm back at home i miss home i miss the city i do love the country i love south carolina i love my grandma I love my mama today. but it don't be a lot to do it don't be a lot to do out there so yeah um i'm back at home i'm so happy to be at home because I've had a, a lot of time to just, you know, relax and just chill and just come up with some more creative ideas, things that I want to do for the month to come and get my thoughts together for the new month that is coming. You know, a whole lot of great vibes going on, always big period, okay? But <clears throat> I have something to show you. So these are my flowers. <laughs> Aren't they beautiful? Oh, these are my beautiful flowers, you guys. I got home. My dad had me some flowers. Like, instantly made me smile. Instantly, it made my day. 
And I'm not gonna read the whole card to you. I'm just gonna read a part of the card that made me cry. I wanna read the whole card, but I'm not gonna do it. Um, it says, you know, basically, okay, it's not gonna make sense if I don't read the card. On your birthday, I want you to know that I'm proud of you, I believe in you, I am here for you, and yes, sometimes I worry about you, but it's only because I love you so much. I'm wishing that this year is one of your best, that you pursue what makes you happiest, and that you see yourself as I do, a beautiful, strong, smart, woman who has so much to offer to this world and y'all i'm tearing up again that those words like ooh, touch me that was right there on the money beautiful okay strong don't ever try to underestimate me okay smart you know i may not have a lot of knowledge in certain things but i, I ain't no dummy i'm not no dummy and you know i literally do have so much to offer to this world you guys we have no idea, you know, if it was if it was easy for everybody, everybody be doing it. But I don't want the easy route. I definitely, I don't know if I spoke of this in my last video. But I had within the new year coming. Like, I already knew before the new year got here. I don't know if y'all remember me saying, but like, I was already saying, like, I'm in 2020. Like, of course not physically, but like, my mindset, my mind, my thoughts, my goals. I was already in 2020 planning and preparing, you know, just for certain stuff and just, I just already knew that, you know, I took some sacrifices, especially with my time and uh, some sacrifices were financial, you know, some was just simply making a decision. And I prayed before I made these decisions because I didn't want to make an irrational decision or not put thought into a decision or be fearful and make a decision out of fear. I'm just happy, y'all. I, I can't be any happy than anything else in this world. Like, I'm just happy, I'm grateful, I'm appreciative, I'm blessed, I'm highly favored. I'm surrounded by people that, you know, love me unconditionally, um, care about me, have my best interests at heart, and that's the kind of people that you want to be surrounded by. I just want to say that 25 was hard. 25 was definitely hard. What I appreciate so much about my YouTube channel is that a lot of you people you know that are subscribed to my channel are not subscribed to my channel. You may have discovered my channel a month ago, two months ago. Some people have literally been here from the beginning of me starting my own channel. Some people have been here way before that. And don't nobody know nothing. Like the Lord or myself, I may say. No, for real. Like, I can literally... Go look at past videos and, and see my growth, feel my growth, know where I was at in that place, like in my mind, like where I was at all around y'all, all around and so relieving to just be where I'm at and just to be comfortable and to have stability and to be so focused, so determined, so motivated and I'm so ready for this year, 26. I am just so ready for what's to come, what's in store. I'm just excited. I have had no complaints in the world. Um, thank you for all the birthday wishes, all the prayers, you know, throughout the whole week. And I love you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. This camera is about to die, but just have a whole lot of great vibes going on, big period. You know I'm celebrating all week, weekend, month, okay? All the time, ho, it might be your season. I'm still celebrating life. Celebrating life for everybody, okay? For everybody who can't celebrate life, I'm celebrating life through you, for you, with you, beside you, through the camera, on the screen. I love y'all. I'm just talking my shit to the camera, die. Peace. Just focus on you, baby girl. <laughs> J-Vibes, you know the vibes. You know the fuck going on. And I'm out this bitch. Yeah. You know the vibes.